Hey ladies, welcome back to my channel. Oh girl, this eye look is what we're doing today. Isn't that gorgeous? No fallout. I think you will love it. It's perfect for any eyes, but especially our mature eyes. Look how pretty it is and look at that shine. So come on with me today and I'll show you how to do this. It's the fastest, easiest eye look you've ever done. So I don't want this to be too long for you. This is going to be the perfect thing you can wear every day. You can dress it up for Christmas. It's absolutely beautiful. There's no fallout in using this eyeshadow that I'm going to show you today. But we're first going to use some eye primer. It doesn't matter what eye primer you use. I'm going to use Unique's very tiny bit, okay? Tiny, tiny. This is second day hair. It's driving me crazy. I can't get it to do anything. <laughs> now, I'm only going to put it on my lids. I'm not taking it all the way up. Uh, I am going to use a concealer to kind of... You see the discoloration? I want to get rid of that. So, we actually are going to use... <laughs> beauty this thing is great but you know it's really messy and you've probably seen me use this before and it's like really messy but great okay because when you open it it's it's just i don't know all the stuff goes everywhere but it's nothing i did because i don't carry it in my purse or anything like that now i'm gonna use a flat brush this is unique's little flat cream shadow brush so we're not going to use much of this very very tiny i'm going to place it right here and then i'm going to use my finger and just to spread it out and upward. I do like um, to put this underneath my brows because it just really does brighten up. But do it a little at a time. You see the difference? And so whatever's left on here, I think I got a little bit left, just lightly tap it right there. And then you just take it right up. If you want to use the brush, please do so. Because you could take the brush and just kind of come underneath it just like that. Kind of go around. See that? Look at the difference. That's going to be so much brighter. And um, you can set it with powder if you want to. I really didn't use a whole lot of, um, I didn't use a whole lot of the eye cream. So I probably will not put anything else over it. I just let it set for a few minutes and let it adhere. And, but this is how you do it. Just layer it and just move it upward. Move it up, move it up. I hope y'all going to have a fabulous Christmas. I know it's so close. I got a little brown spot right there. How I got one right there, I don't know. It's in the brow. <laughs> Luckily, most of it's in the brow, right? Okay. Now, I'm going to let this settle for a few minutes, and then we're going to head into just the quickest eye tutorial ever. Now, the one tool I'm going to use is this brush here. I know it's dirty, but it's <laughs> it has this color on it already. I used it yesterday, but this is a fluffy crease brush by Unique. I love it. It is the best brush ever to use with this, or you want to blend out stuff. Um, it has these little bitty hairs that stick straight up, and it, those are what really spreads it out really nicely. Now, this is the product, and we are going to take this. Now, you can lay it down uh, on your lid if you want to with a doe foot applicator, or you can dip it and just do it. So, but however, I kind of like to just lay it right on my lid like that and then just kind of blend it up. And you're going from corner to outer V. Just make sure you have your brows done so you can kind of push this color up because this is going to be our one color today. I'm not going to add anything else to it. However, you can make it more dramatic like you want it. Um, it is beautiful with an outer V look. And so, Absolutely, you can use anything you want on it or just wear it like this. I'm going to use some liner. I'm going to use black liner. I'm going to use Unique's Perfect uh, liner, and it's so pretty with it. But I'm not actually going to do uh, it on my lid. I'm actually going to do it as a tight line. And tight lining is really good for us older ladies who struggle with doing, you know, liner and making it look like it's a wing. Mine never does because... If you look straight on, I can pull this out, but look, it just goes back and it disappears into that nice little crevice I have there. Um, I'm, I'm lucky to be here. I know that. <laughs> At 61, who would think? At 61, I'd be doing stuff like this, but I love it. I really do. I love doing this. I love uh, unique products. I like all kinds of products. I don't use just one. Oh, that's so pretty. Now, see how that shot? Look at that, girl. Mm, and it's going to dry really quickly. Now I'm going to, I am going to go grab my uh, liner that we're going to use, and we're going to put this up because that's it. 
that's how easy this is. It really is. Now, if you wanted to, we do have the concealer there. If you want to leave it like that, leave it like that. You could come and grab, you know, a lighter color, which I probably, um, like a lighter color like this. Take your brush. Um, make sure it's clean, though. <laughs> grab your brush. This is what I'm going to use. I use BK Beauty brushes, so I'll list what I use below. And just kind of tap this off. Now, this color right here is not available anymore. It's a unique color, but I do love it, and I wear it a lot. And you can just bring it around like that, put it in that inner corner. Now, I will come back at the end and use a little bit of lighter color in that inner corner once I'm totally finished, okay? See how that softens it? I just love, love, love this look, and I think you will too. It's fast and easy. If you want to get out to work, it's going to be perfect for you. One little tidbit that I want you to know, if you're going to use a liner like this, because this one is uh, a pencil liner, make sure you sharpen it every time that before you use it, because you never know what germs are in there. <clears throat> and I have had a few size, and I don't want you to have that. This really sucks when you get those. <laughs> it's that one eye is all swollen. Um, and it takes a while for it to disappear too, so don't do that. So what I'm going to do is, this is, this is perfect. See how well it glides on? I love this color. Uh, we did have a brown color, but it is out of stock. But, however, I think this here looks the best with this look, okay? So, just lift your lid. And it's not going to matter if you touch this. It's not going anywhere, okay? That's the beauty of that, too. And just come down through here and put that lovely, lovely, lovely dark color. You can already see that it's changing it. Do the same thing on this side. And you can always come back and look at it and go, oh, I need a little bit more. And I know sometimes people are squeamish and doing this. I am too, believe me. I see people who can do it like that. I have no idea how they do it. I cannot do that. I just cannot do that. I cannot do that, okay? <laughs> I just can't do it. And I am going to bring it just a tad more down here just to give it that nice little dark look. Oh, I like that. That looks very good. Now, we are going to add some mascara, which I'm going to use Quadra. Uh, you've seen me use Quadra before. Well, I'm going to put some down here, too. A Quadra is a 4-in-1 mascara. It has a serum in it. It has uh, It's a mascara. It's a tubing mascara. Um, it is wonderful. It is absolutely one of the best um, that I have used in a long, long time. And I know it's unique, but my lashes have gotten so long that I can actually see them now. I mean, they have really, look at that, they have really gotten long. And when I use this mascara, it just looks so good now. I really, really do love it. Now, I am going to do one other thing in this outer V corner. I'm not going to do too much with it. I'm just going to use a little bitty brush. Um, and I think I will use, it's, it's, let's see, let's find it one second. Where is my wonderful brush? I am so happy. Here it is. <laughs> This one is my favorite. I think it's 210. It is. It's 210. This is another BK Beauty. Now, if you have trouble and you're not quite sure how to do the liner like this way, you can always do this and get it on the end. And you can definitely come underneath here and just kind of bring the two together. Because I think if we try to draw a line with our wonderful movable skin, um, you won't like it. And the beauty about this is if you mess it up here on the side, all you got to do is use a little bit of concealer and it's gone. And the other cool thing about this product is whatever you're doing, if you're going out for a night or if you are going to a nice party or just a gathering somewhere, this is so simple and easy to put on. And it is absolutely pretty on the skin, on the eyes. You can use this as a, I could use it as a highlight as well. I can use it on my lips. It's a really versatile product, and that's the reason I love it. But see how this just kind of elongates my eye? That's what I'm after. Just elongate a little bit, not a whole lot. And you've got this brush. It's got a very, very tiny tip to it, and it's going to be perfect. Absolutely perfect for you to use and blend out. There we go. Now. I'm going to add mascara off camera because you've seen me do that before. I'll link, I'll try to link uh, my quadra one and you can go back and watch that. But however, I am going to curl my lashes. I do still do that. I do it with my eye curlers and I got to grab those real quick and they're right here. So let's do that real quick before I go. And I want you to see how long these are. I have never had lashes like, look at that. They're just curling right on up. 
<laughs> yeah, it makes me feel like dancing. It does. Oh, I love it because I can see them. Okay, let me go do the mascara and I'll be right back. Okay, what do you think of the lashes? Look. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I absolutely love this. You need to try the mat the that mascara, if nothing else. Um, get you the mascara and get you um the reverent eyeshadow. Oh girl, you're gonna be like <laughs> that's the way I feel. All right, I'm gonna take up this is RMS. This is this is concealer. They call it their um uncover up concealer. I do love it, it's great. I have it under my eyes. But if you, if you want to clean this up, you just use a little bit of this. There's a little tiny brush here. Don't worry, I'll list the brushes. Okay. BK Beauty has some of the best brushes ever. And um, if you watch Hot and Flashy, there's a whole line. She's got a whole line with them. And her those brushes are really cool. Now, these are in this color. And Angie's will be uh, like this color. They'll be in the gray. And she, you can get a whole set. So... Oh, that looks good. That looks fine. That looks good. I think I don't need to do anything else to this. And I just think it's beautiful. Look at that. Gorgeous. Now, the last thing we're going to do is what? That inner corner. And we're going to grab, I'm going to grab that same color I had. I'm going to grab this brush here. This is my favorite brush. Uh, I laid it back over here. So let me grab it. I'm so gray down though. Just take, take a little bit of that light color and pop it here. This is a color unique had that we don't have anymore and it's my favorite. And I have substituted some other colors for it out of other palettes. Um, we have a palette, Humble palette, and it has the similar color in it. And I think there's an Addiction palette that also has this color in it too, a little lighter color. Well, girl, look at that. What do you think? Isn't that pretty? Now, the only other thing I'm going to do, I'm going to take, I'm going to grab this and add some blushing. And I do have on all everything else. So, and it does have a little bit of sheen shine already. And that's just from um, the cream-based blush that I use, which was this Anastasia. Okay. All right. So, let me find a brush for this. I just want something really light. I don't want to be uncomplicated. It's 113 is what we're going to use. This one's really pretty. And... Just kind of dab it in, tap it off, and all you want to do is just place it. I'm just going to take it right up through here. Get that little nice light. And this has, it's got, see how shiny it is? It's got a little pink property to it. Uh, pinks look good on me. I think pinks look good on pretty much on everybody, as long as you're sparing me with it. See, I like to come across my nose with it as well. Down through the center of my face. Like that, okay? Now, the very last thing that I ever do is grab this. And I also grab this because this sets everything. This is unique set in this. Oh my God, it's a primer. And it feels so wonderful on your face. I use it before I do my makeup and I use it when I finish my makeup. Okay. And I'm using our illuminating primer, which I don't, right now it's only in bundles. I'm hoping that they keep it and it becomes part of the line. But oh gosh, it's so pretty. And so that's kind of what you see in the center of my face. I use that. But we're going to use a beauty blender. And yes, this is the original beauty blender. And this is Rev this is Revolution. And this is the Fix and Glow. Oh my gosh. It is a setting spray. Yes, I'm putting it right over here. And my makeup's not going to move. And it smells fabulous. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. Okay. You need to get this. You need to get this. It doesn't matter what age you are. This is the best eyeshadow you will ever use. And when you go to the bathroom or whatever, you're going to look at yourself in the, in the mirror there. And it's going to look just like this all day long. Okay. You're not going to have any fallout. It's not going to wear off. It's not going to do anything to you. Actually take it off with some kind of makeup remover. I promise you, you'll love it. <laughs> so please like and share and click that notification bell. I love it when y'all come and hang out with me. I'm here on Sunday still. Um, hopefully I'll be retiring by the end of next year. That's my plan. And then I'm going to go full force into this and some other things that I want to do also. But I hope y'all try this. Please try it and come back next week. See you later.